Plum sauce. Let me just get that real quick. I should have handed it out. You guys, forgive me for that. But I'm going to take but a second. I marinated the shrimp with the Polynesian sauce from Chick fil A. And I used some of the plum sauce. This is like a teaspoon and a half of each. And the sweet chili sauce. So I marinated that overnight and I had put in some um, oranges, slices I had left and marinated it. So that's where we are. Now I have some tempura batter and this come with a pack of the flour, rice flour. And all you do is add cold water to it. Really simple and quick. So we're gonna dip those in my tempura batter, which I already mixed up with one cup of cold water. And I cut up the vegetables that I had yesterday too. I had some left. So we're gonna fry up the vegetables with it. You know how you go to some of the restaurants, they have the fried vegetables with that. And over here in this bowl, um, I have the uh, some more rice flour. And what I seasoned it with was a little lemon pepper. The uh, Kingford Cajun style seasoning. Uh, you know the basics. Um, onion powder, garlic powder, and a little paprika, and that's it. So I put that. Now over on the fire, I got some peanut oil. It's nice and hot already, you guys. And this, I had turned it down a little bit. Let's put medium high. I don't want it to burn. It's not gonna take long. So what I'm gonna do first is kind of drench it in the rice flour seasoning, and then a tempura batter. Just like that. So it's gonna be extra crunchy. So let's come over and drop one in and see what's happening. Oh yeah, the temperature's right. Now this time I'm gonna do it the opposite direction. I'm gonna put it in the tempura batter. I wanna see the difference. I put that in there, okay. And, oh, yes. See the difference in that coating. Whoa. Okay, that was going to go on that side. So I'm going to have to really pay attention to that. And, and why I'm going to see the difference in the coating, I'm going to get some of the red bell peppers, sweet red or white onions, green bell peppers. And I'm going to drench it in the flour mixture first, the rice flour. Coat it first with that. Okay, nice drench. Then I'm going to put it in the batter batter. Dry batter, wet batter. I know that's going to be so good. And not mixing it too much. Just drizzle the wet batter right over it because I want to keep that dry batter on the vegetables as much as possible. I really want that good crunch. Very lightly. Then I'm going to take them out and put it right on in that oil. Good. Oh, I can't wait, y'all. Yes, I can't wait. I can't wait. The here's a crunch. Like a 4th of, of July explosion. Oh, I think I need to turn up that shirt real quick. Uh oh, I'm gonna catch that. Pan 
too crowded. So I can flip them nicely. Excuse my back. vegetables that way they'd be so crispy and, and light oh my god so that brought back memories and I was like ah because when I made my shrimp grill yesterday it was still good you guys don't get me wrong but um I bet this brings memories back for my sister my mother used to take us downtown LA it used to be a shrimp place in there it had fries the shrimp oh my god they'd be so good and every time we would go to downtown LA to get vegetables and fruit and stuff, my mother would stop and get us the shrimp and the fries. The bomb! Janice, I know you're going to see, right, 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 okay? So that's what I'm hooking up. Sort of that memory, the shrimp was marinating. I try to think about the flavor, the texture, the taste. So I, I might have nailed it. I hope so. So let me... Right over. Oh. Okay, we're gonna be right back when it's done. I'm gonna set the table and I'll be right back out. Okay, everything is done, you guys. Oh my god, it looks so dang delicious. Okay, I can't wait. I'm going to add some chopped chives to it. You know, me and my chives. I love onion. Put a little chopped chives with that. And I added some sweet basil leaves, you guys, and some cilantro in the batter after I, I fried the rest. I Right here, I have the cocktail sauce. I have tartar sauce. And the sauce that I marinated my shrimp in was the plum sauce, sweet chili sauce, and the Polynesian sauce from Chick-fil-A. So let's say the blessing and get right into this. Oh, excuse me, you guys. Dear Heavenly Father, thank you for this lovely dinner. Let it be nourished into my body and mind. For Christ's sake, amen. And happy 4th of July weekend, you guys. And I made my she bong bong uh, mango flavor. Oh my God, perfect. Dear Heavenly Father, thank you so much for this lovely dinner. Let it be nursed into my body and mind for Christ's sake. Lord, bless my viewers out there and uh, keep us all safe in your precious hands. Amen. All right. I'm so hungry, you guys. I'm talking backwards. Mmm. And fried vegetable. And that batter is so crunchy. Mmm. 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 Perfect. And I had some fries from last night left, so I didn't heat them up. I just put them in the oil. Mmm. Made them soft. And then when I was frying the onions, right at the end, I didn't put no batter on them. I just fried them all together with the french fries. They heat them up, and the oil smells so good from the onions and the garlic. Mmm. 